Hello friend, welcome back to Auto Resource Channel. I have here another video which is that mini series about the service repair and maintenance of steel chainsaws. And in this short video we will touch on one of the common issues which is basically the poor acceleration maybe even like a starving and, and let me first show you outside what I mean with that poor acceleration and engine actually uh, dying under the throttle you can hear it, the saw cannot accelerate at all also doesn't hold a good idle, but you can hear it, it, it can accelerate. It's choking, it's like starving. So in the short demonstration, you saw how the, the uh, chainsaw cannot really uh, run. It cannot uh, reach the high speed and it's kind of choking and struggling to run. Obviously, you can start immediately tinkering with the chainsaw or even better, seek help in the literature which was made for troubleshooting of these awesome chainsaws. So let's use this troubleshooting manual. Obviously there could be uh, many many reasons why the acceleration is bad and at the end uh, the engine is stalling. Uh, but let's let's use this uh, graph. Basically, they say idle jet too lean, main jet could be too lean, inlet control lever too low, inlet needle sticking to valve seat, connecting board to atmosphere block, diaphragm gasket leaking, or metering diaphragm damaged or shrunk. So let's go with the easiest one, which will be backing off the low speed screw slightly. So that, that's very easy adjustment, it's not even a repair and hopefully that will be the solution. Also this manual provides information about this condition and possible fix. And I'm on the page 45 it's a chapter 10.3 tank vent and we can read here. It's an erratic idling behavior, poor acceleration and basically what's happening is that idle setting it's too lean. Solution, which will be very easy, turn the low speed screw L counterclockwise until the engine runs and accelerates smoothly. So let's do it. And that is done in this area. You have high and here is the L for the low. There are two openings. You need really narrow screwdriver which will fit there and you gently put it inside. See the Okay, now I now perfectly I can feel the the screw, the adjusting screw on the carburetor, and I will be turning in counterclockwise, which means to the left right now. And I will turn it very little bit. Because they say even very small changes will make a huge difference. And now I will go, remove it and go try again outside. <laughs> And here you got it my friend, this was fortunately very simple repair, it was basically adjustment not even repair. So stay tuned, even better subscribe because I will have way more videos about the service, repair and maintenance of steel chainsaws on this channel. Thanks for watching and have a wonderful day!